Welcome back to Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. This is not your host. Thank you guys so much for the support and likes. It really means a lot. If you guys are brand new, don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe. You guys can follow me on Twitch and Twitter. Ladies and gentlemen, it is showtime. I'm going to let you guys know right now, this game has just been amazing. I have tried to play this mission I don't know how many times. And I'm going to tell you right now, I just keep getting bothered. I am going to definitely get new saddlebags. I actually read in the comments, and thank you so much. Uh, for that to let me know I am gonna do that to make sure that I have enough to where I'm not overheated there but other than that ladies and gentlemen this game has been great I know where I need to go so we're gonna head up over here past this wagon this game has just been wonderful I've loved playing it I have a lot of games coming out I'm working on finishing up GTA 5 a lot of few other games so just bear with me I just ended up subscribing to again to the actual PlayStation now and it's really great a lot of PlayStation 3 games you know so we've got like God of War we've got like Uncharted series you know we've got so much coming to the channel ladies and gentlemen so please please bear with me here all right we're actually gonna examine these tracks here traces of ice around the footprints really Tortured him. Maybe they missed something. Need to check his pockets. Trousers are stiff, as if hung out to dry midwinter. Maybe hid something in his jerkin. Damn, he's cold as ice. Nothing here. Should check his boots. Blood, congealed. Key hidden in his boot. Gotta fit a keyhole. Somewhere nearby, hopefully. Okay, so we got something updated. Alright, Hendrick. Let's see, we got something else around here. Boy, I just felt my controller vibrate. Don't know why I needed a mug. But my controller vibrated. Like, really badly. Oh, right there it is. Is there something we're missing on him? Nope, it doesn't look like it. Ooh, here we go. We got a rug. All right, let's take this down. See, I don't know what's going on. I don't know if you guys have this problem either, but even though I'm in the Witcher senses, it finally popped up. I don't know if it's popped up directly on the video, but it took a minute for it to pop up to examine this, but we're going to right now. If you guys are having the same problem, let me know in the comments as well. There's a draft. Gotta be a space under this rubble. Guess I should do some cleaning. Hey, that's actually pretty nice. I like the way they did that. Let's see here. Do we have something else to examine? No. All right, I'm gonna loot. Now, I know I need to see a blacksmith. I have to replenish my swords. I know I have to sell swords and take swords apart. You know, there's a lot of things that I have to do here in this game. It's like Skyrim and like Shadows of Morador. We all know that. I'm just doing my best to try to keep this actually rolling here. Let's see. We've got to actually read this. Let's do it. Now see, in some of the parts of the world, it looks like we can only ignite certain candles. I don't know why. I know I want to work a lot on the alchemy and things like that, getting that going. I want to spend a lot of time in that. I want to do side quests as well, ladies and gentlemen. So you just got to really bear with me. There's going to be a lot of side quests that we have to do. Some levels we can't do because there's certain levels that of side quests that is just really hard and you have to be a certain level to do them. It, I wouldn't recommend going out there at a level 4 or a level 5 and doing a side quest that's a level 33 or a 50. It, I might be exaggerating on the 50, but you know, you want to just take your time at this, and that's what I want to do, and I want to enjoy the game. 
So let's do this. Let's examine this book, it looks like. A ledger. Payment for a sack of grain. Amount due for a charcoal shipment. Hendrik was masquerading as a merchant. Hmm, what's this? Notes among the ledger entries. Clever. Interesting headings. Missing and wanted. Subject appeared in Skellige. Also sighted in Novigrad. Appearance unchanged. Ashen hair. Scar on her face. Avoids contact with others. Drunken swine. So-called Baron hosted subject at his castle. Or should I say, illegally appropriated fort. Reason unknown. Talk to Baron at Crow's Perch. Clashed with a witch. Subject landed in swamp. Encountered a witch. Conflict ensued. Cause unknown. Find the witch. Talk to the peasantry. Village of Midcops. Caution advised. I'm being observed. Don't know by whom or why. Unsettling signs. Dog ran off. Water in bucket froze solid. Strange glow observed in the sky. Ill omen, peasants say. Somehow they learned Hendrik was looking for Ciri. Thus the torture. I'm too late. My only leads, the Baron, and some witch. Damn. Okay, so his only leads are the Baron and the witch. Character entry updated, Hendrik. Alright, we got 100 points for that. It would have been nice if we would have got a little bit more points than what we did. That's alright, though. Alright, we'll get on out of here. Go to the Baron's castle. Oh, man, we got to go there now. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's where we're going to head off to. But, ladies and gentlemen, if you guys know a good blacksmith in this game, let me know where to actually go. Leave that in the comments below. You know, because I am asking you guys. I would like to know that. Let's see here. we got to actually call him, so that's what we're doing. Where is he? Okay, come on, Roach. Get on over here, buddy. Now, before I do anything, what I want to do is I actually want to meditate because it replenishes my health and that's what I want. In case I do have to get into a fight, I do want to spend a lot of time, like I said, in the alchemy. And one more thing, I want to know where we can actually learn how to sword fight. I know Witcher, uh, not Witcher, but, um, oh, what is it? Shadows of Morador. I know the fact that you got to actually learn how to fight in that and they had like a fighting rank and a sword rank and you got to get sword experience and leveled up and everything like that so if you guys know where to go let me know i i would really love to know because i'm like stumped on that let's see is there any flowers gonna pop up on that mini map that's what i'm more concerned about right now if there is i want to get them okay there is so it looks like it must it might be up over here all right i see it it's got to be that right there okay cool now i don't mind doing like side quests and things like that and fighting that yeah. doesn't have i don't have a problem with that that doesn't bother me as much so just bear with me like i said i'm, I'm only one person and i've got a lot of games coming out for you guys so if you guys just bear with me i'd really appreciate it all right yeah i can't run which is all right i mean It's mean. It's mean because I can't run. It's a meanie. But other than that, it's a great game. I love the fact of the wilderness. The wilderness is wonderful. I, I have to say that. I mean, can I run with Roach? Okay, so I can run with Roach. That ain't no problem. He can gallop pretty fast, which is awesome. Ooh, there's another flower. I want to get out and grab it. I don't know. Have you guys been having any problems with... Not being able to get off Roach, sorry, ladies and gentlemen, I didn't want to cough in the mic. But are you been having glitches like that? Please let me know also in the comments below as well if you guys have any problems with that. Because I know I've been having some problems getting on him and getting off of him. So it's one of those things where, you know, I try to get off, but I can't. And then, you know, I get stuck where I, he well, won't let Roach. me. 
get off. Let's see here. What is down there? Faster. I don't know. Ooh, whoops. There's another flower somewhere. I don't want to miss it here. I think it's up over this way. I want to try and collect as much flowers as possible. Ooh, did I go past it? Yes, I did. It's right here. There's like all these flowers that we could just grab. Now, I don't know what flowers we need. Like I said, I'm going to do my best and figure this out. Totally. Looks like we can grab all those. Okay, that's pretty good. I want to grab that. I don't know what that actually creates. I think there's another flower. It's up over here. Ooh, I think this is the one we might need, ladies and gentlemen, for a mutagen. Ooh, yes, that's cool. All right. So it's really good to actually go around the actual world and actually collect all this stuff. Let me see something here. I don't know if I can do that on Roach. Can I? Oh, yep. Sorry about that. Let's look at the alchemy here. No. See? Okay, I got one. Okay, I think I'm fine now. Crow's Eye we need and we need that right there as well. So if you guys know where a crow's eye is, I think that's called Pring Grape. So if you guys know where that stuff is, let me know as well. We also need mistletoe and we need white gill. So let me know where that stuff is if you guys know because I'd like to create some mutagen really badly. Man, I just find it, all these flowers. I mean, it's a good thing that we're sitting here doing this. Uh-oh. I may get into a fight, ladies and gentlemen. I see it. I think I see some orgs down there. No, they're just deer. Now, I don't know if we're allowed to go hunting or not. I don't know if we can kill the deer. I mean, I don't want to kill the deer, but if it plenishes my health and stuff like that, I don't mind it. Uh, where did Roach go? Okay, Roach is over here. I keep forgetting I can't run. But as soon as we get into this town and go to this castle, I definitely want to find a blacksmith I don't know how much gold we have but I don't know like if we see the gold or not see the gold but actually take our stuff and get gold for it that's what I'm kind of concerned about I have no idea if you guys oh, know if we do get gold for tearing our stuff apart like rebuilding it and stuff that we pick up or is it only by selling I'd like to know that as well All right, looks like we got some more of this Okay, we got Bring Blossom. That's pretty good. Now, what's the other one over here? Now, I know I'm stopping. I may make this video just a little bit longer because I want to actually grab some of these flowers and things like that and show you guys where they are because this way you'll know. But this is some stuff we're actually going to need for, like I said, actually building potions and building the alchemy and things like that. So just bear with me, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, see, we got a bandit camp. All right, we're just going to have to run because I am not going to try to fight them. Blow yourself. Okay, here we go. Now, I could fight him if that's what it took, but I don't have enough to actually fight them. I probably could. Oh, man. Yeah, see, they're trying to kill me. Oh, I got an arrow stuck in me. Look at that. Yeah, their arrows are nasty. I'll go back and fight them once my swords are fixed. We'll definitely do that side quest. I'm not going to lie to you there. We will do it, so just bear with me. I don't know what that flower is over there, but I'm actually going to get it here. Looks like it's up over this way. But I definitely want to learn all about the sword fighting and things like that. So if you guys know where to go, I don't want to fist... Whoa, that was weird. I don't know why he did all that now. We're just collecting flowers. And there's someone over here. Okay, let's see. We got... Some mushrooms. And some more mushrooms. Okay, that's fine. But I think you got to be like a level 33 to actually do that question mark. But I don't know. I don't mind doing it. Like I said, I don't 
mind fighting whatsoever, but I know we got to go to this castle. So this might do it for the video when I actually get up here, and then we'll go from there. Because like it says, it says, Bloody Baron, go to the castle. So that's what we'll do. I'll check out this video, see how it is, watch the commentary in it. Go from there. It's usually what I do. If the commentary is bad, I don't put up a video. That is like, no, no. You don't put up a video with bad commentary whatsoever. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, I will see you guys in a little